you know, these guys saw Bitcoin and they said, this is awesome. How do we do something like Bitcoin, but for AI? We have the creation of interconnected commodity markets. The most powerful computational technique that humanity has ever invented. The incentive mechanism that drives BitTensor, this is really the differentiator. And what this does is it leverages this huge connected decentralized computing power. Crunching training data for LLMs. And we're producing intelligence at a massive scale. We're, we're bridging this gap between the power of having open source and, and the power of having centralized monetization. And in an incentivized network, what this does is it strives for betterment and improvement, natural Darwinistic improvement of the network. Like basically the product and the market are interacting a lot faster than it is anywhere else. And so you, you basically get this accelerated evolution of products. How do we democratize access with AI tools and yet still put some level of guardrails? And I think that it's, it's going to run away no matter what we do. It's, it's really about who it runs away with. I find it a little bit more terrifying that a single company would own AGI um, compared to all of us owning a piece of it. We use open ownership and digital currencies to allow people to like tether themselves to the technology, as many people as possible. Mm -hmm. So that we, if we are collectively symbiosis, in symbiosis with this technology, then, then it's not going to fight against us because we are its bottom line. I came across BitSensor. The idea really solved the, the problem I was having, which was this censorship. Question of what can or cannot be done with AI is answered collectively in a democratic way. The only way that we can actually come close to achieving something like AGI or something resembling AGI is through all of us working together combined. AI is going to become a common platform. And because it's a common platform, it needs to be open source if you want it to be a platform on top of which a whole ecosystem can be built. And I think it's this ability to integrate monetization into the open source community. That's how we can actually build things that are bigger and more powerful than centralized companies. This is the best way to make progress as fast as we can. Out of responsibility to the future humans we could carry, right, with higher carrying capacity by scaling up civilization, I think we have to make the greater, grander future happen. So essentially, we are creating this incredibly powerful network that's not just in the hands of a few, but open to everybody.